family, we have gathered in this holy and sacred hour to witness the uniting of two devoted hearts into the enduring bonds of marriage. Samantha, a long time ago you left me a little note in my notepad that I would like to read to everyone. You wrote, you are the best person to ever happen to me. I never thought a love like this would ever be possible. And look who was wrong. Yep, me. Thank you very much for never walking away, never giving up, never letting the other shoe drop, so to speak. You are my knight in shining armor. You are my everything. Now marry me, damn it. <laughs> Samantha, I kept that note all these years because one day I knew this was going to happen. So, in front of all our friends and family, I would like to say that I will never walk away, I will never give up, and I will never let the other shoe drop, and forever I will continue to prove you wrong. <laughs> You're the best person to ever happen to me, and I love you very much. Dear Ryan, I thought today would never come. All the obstacles it took to stand here today just further proved that you and I can make it through anything. I truly never thought the day would come where I met a man who wanted to spend the rest of his life with me, who would go through the journey of parenting and adulting together, who would make me the happiest person alive, who would actually want to wake up every morning to me. Walking into that bar eight years ago and getting the courage to buy you a beer was the best thing that ever happened to me. <laughs> I know I'm not the easiest to handle at times, and I'm going to drive you crazy for the rest of your life, but I promise to try and keep my crazy to a minimum. I promise to love you with every fiber of my being until my very last breath. I hope we never stop laughing so hard we cry. I hope we never lose our way, but if we do, I pray we always find a way back to each other. Ryan Michael O'Keefe, thank you for making me the luckiest girl in the world. <clears throat> I love you more today than yesterday, and I'll love you more even more tomorrow, forever. And so Ryan, I'm gonna ask you first, do you, Ryan, take Samantha to be your wife? I do. And do you, Samantha, take Ryan to be your husband? I do. And now because of your desire to be joined together as in marriage, I pronounce that you are, in fact, husband and wife. Ryan, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it gives me a great privilege to present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Ryan and Samantha O'Keefe. I remember when she first started tell, talking to me about Ryan. We were sitting in my kitchen and I cut her off and told her I didn't want to hear anything else about this guy because I wanted to make sure it was serious before we had to deal with emotions. And then moving forward, I remember when she called me from the doctor's office telling me she was pregnant. I was like, oh man, she really likes this guy. I guess I should get to know him a little bit. <laughs> and it turns out we do like Ryan. So here we are. So we'll make it short and sweet, and we'll just toast to Ryan Samantha and a long, happy marriage. I gotta say, ever since I met you, Sam, you've been a rock of support for me um, and this bloke, obviously. 
Uh, but I just can't express how much I love these people and I'm happy to have them as a part of my life and to even pay you to be a part of this ceremony and to stumble and mumble through this without literally crying on the microphone. So uh, I just want you all to raise your glasses and just celebrate the life of these two amazing folks.